But like I told you before, that doesn't negate the responsibility of the man on his position to make sure he protects his seed. And you're blaming women uh -oh. receiving the seed, but you're not blaming men for planting a seed in the wrong soil. So, so let me give you an example of how that looks, okay? Because I have mm. a, and so my thing is, you don't want any kids. It is up to you to protect yourself. Nobody's responsible for protecting you besides Thank you. Thank Nobody you. Nobody can protect you. So I tell my son, because I have no control over the female. I don't know her. But I tell my son, if you don't want a disease, if you don't want a baby, you have to protect yourself. I'm not, yes. you, you, cannot, you cannot give your your fate up to somebody else somebody you won't even trust your wallet to that's first and foremost so why are you trusting the most valuable thing that you have which is your legacy legacy to somebody so i place the responsibility on my son because he can control himself he can control anybody else so if you know that this is not the future that you want then you have to be responsible for for you she can't be responsible for you you have to be responsible mm -hmm. and in my daughter i would tell her the same thing Listen, only person who's responsible for you is you. If you don't want no ill, you know, kids out here and you, you know, without marriage, if you don't want to, you know, if you want to, you know, whatever it is, I tell her. If you want marriage with a good guy, this is how you do. You, I teach because people have to be responsible. You cannot place the blame on somebody else for, for something you. that you can control. Is there something that you can control? I think that conversation is for the women and I can think it's conversations for men because they both can control it from their side. They just choose not to control it. And now that they have made a decision to not control, because that's a decision you make together. You cannot be mad at the product because we are all smart people around here. We know what have hunching without a condom leads to mm -hmm. reproduction. So we can't be surprised mm -hmm. when little Jimmy's head sitting right there because we knew that that's what happens. The possibility, yeah. When sperm meets egg. Mm -hmm. You understand what I'm saying? We got to start thinking. I, I, I agree with that. I, I agree with that. But but when, when we try to make all men to be leaders, let's take it. Do you believe that every single man that's a man is a leader? Oh, absolutely not. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. So for you to hold all men accountable and say, hey, you should be doing this and you should be doing that. If you understand that all men are not leaders, then you can't say, well, just because a woman gets with a man, that's that's on him. If she's picking a non-leader, that was on her. I think, I think Ms. Dickie was saying that's on both of them. I don't that's think she was, was saying it's to. on him. I think yeah. she was saying that's on both. But of them. she picked a non-leader, though. She but picked up a bad guy. But the thing about it is we don't even know what kind of mind she was in. She picked a non because we don't even know the kind of mind she was in. You'll be amazed I, that so 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 I, I yes, would even argue, right? I would even argue the fact that yes, two people came and some people never get out of that dysfunction, but I would argue that sometimes a kid will grow you up real fast, will mature you real fast. Now you got another mouth. You know, that's what we would want to happen. If you have a child, now you're going to think a little different. I hate when people say, why you why you increase your standards when you had a kid? Why would you want a baby around low standard? Like that, that doesn't make any sense to mm -hmm. me. Like if you're not for yourself, at least do it for your child. And high standards can mean just a good hearted person. Maybe that was a shit ass man. You, you found out he was shit when you had a baby with him or maybe y'all just didn't do right sometimes higher standard is not about income sometimes higher standard is about how does he treat you is he a good example for your kids to follow is he somebody you you don't mind your kids looking up to because he's a good role model for your kids that's a higher standard so you will want a single mom to deal with somebody of a higher caliber or of some high caliber because when they don't that's when we start seeing this stuff on the news about things happening to children in the household because mama done laid up with somebody she ain't had no business laying up with and now the kid is suffering. But but Miss Taken is saying that's the man's fault if, if she lays up with somebody that she ain't supposed to be laying up with. No, I said it's the man's fault for impregnating, impregnating her. Like, it, like what, I'm trying to say, 
Right, the original man. What I'm saying is, is equal responsibility on both parts. It's not, you but just you, said women have control just, over sex. How can it be listen, equal when you got control? But you have no, control but over, right, so so women have control over sex, but two people have to do it to make a baby, right? Both, both. You need a sperm and an egg to make a baby. Do, a woman do I have, have equal? Do I have equal control if if she has a baby? Can I say no and she says yes? Is it equal? You, you have you have control before before the pregnancy. She has it. control after she get pregnant. It's so no if different from this is, than wear a condom. It's no different from your argument about a woman huh? being with you and she knows she wants marriage, right? It's the same thing. She has because you, you're saying your argument was well, she has control. She don't gotta be here if she don't want to be here, knowing that it's the same thing with you. Well, you I'll ain't say, gotta be there, you I'll, ain't gotta see the neck girl. I'll say this. I'll say this to Caesar. Caesar, I no, know that no. looking at Caesar when we say if, if she decides she doesn't, she can get an abortion, she can no. take a plan B, she can no. she can send the baby no. to a safe haven. You have a place where you don't have to be responsible for a mistake, but the man still has to be responsible. We do no. not have equal control. Not, you don't even have to have a mistake. Just like she has the option of having sex with her, you have the option of saying no. On the listen. See on the window or the wall, anywhere. But if but if you decide to get with a non-leader, you sat on the window or the wall, anywhere besides them draws. Besides them draws, you could have pulled. Like it's so many. Listen, it's so many free methods that don't require medicine, that don't require killing a kid. Like just there, there are methods you can that are in full control of with a man that you can use. To protect your seed. Okay. Throw an umbrella on it. Yeah. Um, Caesar, Caesar, here's the thing. So, I know it could be very. So, so, no, no, no. so Caesar, Caesar, should the man put the umbrella on or should the woman make the man put the umbrella on? He, he, okay. Let me tell you this. This is real talk right here. And wow. I, was, I told my son. I can't this. That's a question. Now, let me tell you this. The person who don't want the kid needs to put the umbrella on Thanks. because at the end of the day you need to protect i just told you you need to protect yourself why are you rely on her to protect your seat when you the one who don't want a kid obviously, who does the more damage listen who has more responsibility you have a whole baby coming out listen 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 but you sit here arguing about what he got to do with child support right so undoubtedly you saying he got some responsibility all i'm saying is if you don't want no children you have to be responsible the person who does not want it has to be responsible for protecting themselves it is. It's not rocket science. Like I don't know. I'm not understanding why this concept. Caesar, is Caesar, so Caesar, the other thing you can do is get with a woman who requires patience. You're, you're picking and choosing. You're, you're saying the woman has has control right, no, over sex, but then you're you're putting the man and say, well, he I needs can't. to put a, 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 a umbrella on. Why would he though? What? But why would he? That's just dumb. That's just a dumb mistake. At this day and age, we should know that that's dumb. Why would you, if you know you don't want to have a baby with this kid and you know your sperm are like little babies, like why would you protect the little baby? Like, like I'm not, so so, so let, this is what I'm talking about. So you talk about being a leader, but you don't even want to take the step to protecting your sperm. How can you protect the household when you can't even protect your sperm? And that's something that's coming out of you. 